in this question, the inverse of the function f such that r plus is mapped onto r, where f of x equals 1 on the square root of x plus 4, is one of these. So to find the inverse, you need to swap x and y. And a good thing to do first is to let x equal, let's just go back one step, let y equal that function first of all. They like you to do this in the short answer to actually put this let y equals and then swap x and y. So swapping them, you get, so this becomes x equals 1 on the square root of y plus 4. And then next step, get rid of this 4 by minusing from both sides and you end up with x minus 4 equals 1 on the square root of y. To undo the square root, square that fraction and do the same on this side, square that. This will undo the square root and you'll end up with 1 on y. And I'm going to leave it on that side. So x minus 4 squared equals 1 on y. And when you have something here that is not a fraction and this is the thing you want, you just swap those two and you end up with y equals 1 on x minus 4 squared and therefore uh, f minus 1 of x equals 1 on x minus 4 squared. All right, so that's the inverse function and what you need to do because they've specified the domain for the inverse, so the domain of f to the minus 1 is equal to the range of the original f function. So you need to figure out the range of this one. So letting, keeping that as y equals 1 on the square root of x plus 4. This, and it's for positive reals. And this, remember, is always the domain. So the square root of x graph looks like, just roughly like that. And the turning point, if you like, is at naught naught. 1 on the square root of x is a graph like that. And then plus 4 will move that graph up 4. And you'll have something like a y asymptote here, y equals 4, a y asymptote, a horizontal asymptote is what I meant to say. And then this shape in here like that. This is approaching the y-axis, which is an asymptote. And this is approaching y equals 4, which is an asymptote. So from that, you can get the range, the set of y values that belong to this function. And lowest y value, this is going down, approaching y equals 4, but not equaling it. So that will have a round bracket. And this end here is heading up towards a positive infinity. So that means that this domain of the inverse, which is equal to this, is just equal to 4 comma infinity. And that's actually answer A up here. We have actually got the right function. Um, yes, this is it, 1 on x minus 4 in a bracket squared. So the only other one that was the same was this one. And they've gotten minus infinity to positive 4, which is definitely not the range of this function. So that's the answer A. And that's how you do this kind of question.